This is Figuring It Out Together with me, Dr. Michael Nasius. Today I'm going to talk briefly about getting our kids ready for school. Um, so back to school clearly means something different in 2020 due to the coronavirus. And I want to share with you what I'm learning from the kids to whom I speak um, in our therapy sessions. What I hear, interestingly, um, from many kids is um, they're concerned about going back and they're concerned about perhaps, you know, the academic experiences they might miss out on um, if they are doing school once again from home. And of course, you know, they're sad about um, not being able to see their friends every day um, like they're used to if they end up having to learn from home. But um, what I hear from our, from our youth over and over is they're afraid of getting sick and they're even more afraid of um, transmitting the virus um, to people they love, like parents and or grandparents, which I actually find quite um, admirable um, that our kids are kind of thinking not just about themselves, which kids are, are want to do, uh, but instead, you know, they're thinking about us and about other people they love. They're also thinking about and worrying about their teachers getting sick. So what can we do to help our kids prepare for going back to school, particularly if the doors open and our kids are back? Um, and what I, I think we simply need to focus on as parents is um, their, um, their, their understanding of what it's going to look like and their thoughts about, um, you know, what it may feel like. So we need to invite them to talk and we need to listen. And instead of being reassuring right away, which of course is what we should do, we need just to listen. We need to pause. We need to give them an opportunity to talk. We need to show them we're interested. We need to ask good questions. And then once we hear what's on their mind, then and only then, we can share our own views about um, thoughts they might want to wrestle with or entertain in an effort to find peace as they go back to school. I should say peace and you know optimism and joy and enthusiasm about the school uh, the next 10 months, whatever they will look like. So listen, hear, and then and only then comment share what you think will be beneficial for them to think about so that the school year is a good one. Thank you.